This uh, one and a half years were pretty intense because when uh, all the pandemic happened back in March 2020, um, I was pretty depressed and surprised uh, that all the shows were getting cancelled. But uh, then I decided to not, not to focus on all the bad things, but better create something that I never really got time to do before. I'm uh, recording two albums alongside with uh, my friends from uh, my hometown Krasnodar. So it's gonna be something that's still my music, still fingerstyle, but also uh, other musicians really make, made it way more interesting to me and inspiring. So I'm, I'm really, I really can't wait to share. So this is the prototype. We've been uh, working with Baton Rouge guitars for quite some time, and uh, I really like how how it turns out. Uh, it's still a prototype, so it's not completely finished. But uh, I really hope we can uh, we can fine tune everything, and uh, uh, so I could tour with this guitar. I could play shows with that guitar because I really enjoy all the ideas that we put into here, and there are so many. Uh, unique things that we can talk about. So uh, yeah, at first we can start with something that's the most visible. It's the weird frets. So they are weird. They're called fan, fr fan frets and uh, they just allow me to tune my guitar lower while keeping the tuning stability because we have the longer scale for the bass string and uh, it means that the longer scale means uh, higher tension. So it means I can play like a drop A or like drop G, or drop F and it wouldn't be sounding too buzzy and too like like this because uh, because the tension is still going strong. That's why I have these frets. And also, there are lots of frets because I want to see my twenty fourth my twenty fourth fret all the time. I don't want it like to be just in the air. I want to see the frets. And um, also, yeah, the the pack head is the same as I have on all my guitars with banjo tuners on it, so I can do. I can do these funny tricks, as I always do. But what makes it really special is this hip shot bridge that we have on this guitar that also allows me to tune strings on the fly, not only from the headstock, headstock side, but also from uh, the bridge side, which is very exciting. So you can play a note, uh, like... Oh, sorry. You can play a note, then you can have a note lower, and then you have another low note, which is even lower than that. So we have three notes per string on this side, so we have one, two, three, and then you have another note here. So we have four notes per string that you can tune on the fly. So we have. And uh, you can do that with any string. Talking about the simplified, uh, more affordable version of my signature, uh, it's it's also something that I feel great responsibility for, because uh, and, and I'm ready to put as much work and time in it to make uh, to make it something that I'm ready to share with people, to make it something that wouldn't disappoint them, even though it wouldn't be the same exact guitar. So uh, regarding the things that should be there, it's of course the, the general looks and feel of this guitar, because uh, there are reasons why I love bigger body guitars, there are reasons why I chose this exact wood combination and uh, frets and uh, things and cutaway and things like that that uh, made playing for me natural and uh, it's, it's something that I feel like it's my body size, that it's something that uh, I chosen, have, have chosen, chose after the years of, uh, of trying out different 
different things. And this is something that definitely should be there. But regarding the more fancy things like bridge and tuning pegs, uh, it's, it would cost a lot of money, so I'm thinking it might be like an additional options that you can add to this guitar if you really want to use these uh, possibilities. Or you can just go without it, because uh, the whole guitar should be working just as a regular guitar too, even if you're not a fingerstyle player at all. If you, even if you just want to strum some chords, it would still should be sound and look like a nice proper guitar. And that's what we're working on.